एंड टू बी ऑनेस्ट बिफोर प्रोग्रामिंग पार्टशाला आई डी डोंट इवन रियली नो लाइक ग्राफ सोल्व कैसे करते या एक्जेक्टली उनका लाइक जिस कॉन्सेप्ट मालूम था बट हाउ टू सोल्व प्रॉब्लम ऑन दैम आई नेवर यू Yeah. Uh, right from the beginning, uh, the videos were uh, made in such a way that a person will think about like how to optimize a solution. Like we'll start from the most brute force approach, and then we'll always try to think about the efficient solution. Actually, mention a lot about yourself. Like whatever you have done, don't feel uh, less in confidence about that. If you have done something, just mention it. So I was kind of uh, lacking in motivations. Like I thought I would not be able to do it by giving enough time. Yeah. But whenever I had any such issues, I always reached out to Anup Bhaiya, and he always assured me that the progress that I have made is uh, already good enough, and I should just keep continuing it. Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Success Stories with Programming Part Shala. It has been a long time since we last met, and I hope you all had an amazing Diwali weekend and also all the festivities that follow thereafter. Now that we are back with the success stories, today we have Sandesh with us. So Sandesh has recently gotten placed with Mystify as their SDE, and he has made a major shift uh, from working in a support domain to finally making his shift into the dev domain, and also coming from a service-based company that is Accenture to being in a product-based company. Finally, that is Mystify. So let's. Look into his interview and get to know everything about his interview journey with Mr. Fly. Also, his experience with the Renaissance, our handcrafted course to track top tech product based companies. You can also visit the link in our description section to take a free trial for yourself today and also begin this journey for yourself to become an amazing software development engineer out there. Let's get into it. Hi, Sandesh. How have you been? I'm doing good. How are you? गुड गुड ठीक है सो संदेश लेट्स बिगिन विद योर इंट्रोडक्शन बता दो आप कहां पे हो क्या करते हो एंड एवरीथिंग राइट सो बेसिकली आई लिव इन मुंबई एंड आई कंप्लीटेड माय ग्रेजुएशन इन 2021 ओके एंड सिंस देन आई हैव बीन वर्किंग विद एक्सेंचर इन अ सपोर्ट रोल एंड लाइक आई जॉइंड एक्सेंचर इन जून 2021 एंड लाइक आई गॉट इनटू अ सपोर्ट रोल and since then i had made up my mind like uh, i want to get uh, placed in a product based company and since then i decided to take a switch as soon as possible so mm-hmm. I, yeah. that's nice mm-hmm. so you have basically made your switch from a service based to a product based company that is correct how yeah. does it how does it feel finally you have made it on your own it feels really good because uh, there is a leap in two different things one is that switch from a service based company to product based company and secondly there is a switch from a support role to a finally dev role which i always wanted yes 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 aur aapka education background kaisa raha like from your college itself when you decided ki aapko coding pursue karna hai aapko programming karna hai aapka future aap software development engineer mein chahte ho how was the whole process for you to be honest i did not uh, think a lot about it during my college days i was like just uh, i'll just get placed into any company uh, whichever comes first in yeah. my college placements but uh, later actually when i got placed i was happy for some time but later on i realized that, that even in uh, this particular uh, field there are many different roles and i should be uh, targeting a particular one that i like because i i always thought that i would like any role but after i got placed into a support role i realized that i should be uh, working on something uh, for which like i am a part of it like i'm uh, help, helping and building it rather than supporting it right right i guess after a point of time you get to realize that you know i am meant for something bigger than what i am doing right, right. now and that's what you felt and that's how you made your change and also service based se product based mein aana dev role mein aana it's a big thing and it's a big achievement so congratulations to you for that uh coming to your interview experience with mystify you are you have been placed with mystify as their sde kaisa raha complete interview experience right from the first call to receiving your offer letter I mean, I did not take it that smoothly, Jayega. But thanks to programming partially, like uh, the first round was a coding round, and it really went really very smooth because uh, they had asked me two questions, both based on graphs. And to be honest, before programming partially, I did not even really know like uh, graphs solve कैसे करते या exactly उनका like just concept मालूम था, but how to solve problems on them, I never knew. But uh, I mean, when it just उन्होंने जैसे ही मुझे क्वेश्चन आज किया आई जस्ट गॉट द अप्रोच राइट इन माय माइंड एंड जस्ट स्टार्टेड कोडिंग इट राइट अवे या या एंड द आई मीन द मोस्ट इंपोर्टेंट थिंग इज जो क्वेश्चंस आए थे इंटरव्यू में दैट सेम क्वेश्चन आई हैड सॉल्व्ड इन प्रोग्रामिंग पार्ट चैलेंज वाओ दैट वाज अ मेजर रीजन 
इट्स इट्स वेरी फैमिलियर फिर वो लगता है कि यार ये पहले किया हुआ है सो राइट सो एक इंस्टेंटली क्लिक हो जाता है कि आई विल बी एबल टू सॉल्व दिस एंड देन वो कॉन्फिडेंस के बेसिस पे दिस कर रहे हैं एग्जैक्टली कॉन्फिडेंस इज ऑल दैट मैटर्स लाइक यू नो व्हेन यू आर सिटिंग इन एन इंटरव्यू एंड यू फील कॉन्फिडेंट अबाउट यू नो अ क्वेश्चन और अ प्रॉब्लम तो वो इंटरव्यूअर को भी दिख जाता है कि अगर इसने हल्की सी मिस्टेक भी करी है तो वो कॉन्फिडेंट है ही कैन लर्न अहेड तो दैट्स हाउ मेनी राउंड्स ऑफ इंटरव्यू डिड यू डू so i had kind of uh, two rounds uh, the first one was a coding round uh, okay. it was also outsourced to interview vector okay. then purely coding round then second one was a technical interview uh, so the people from industry fly took the interview yeah. basically it consists of, of different concepts like basic technical questions and uh, system design uh, low level design questions hmm. and then uh, later on i received a call from hr so it was like a short uh, telephonic interview with the hr right Right, right. Nice. And how long did the process uh, took this time for you? Like, कितना time लगा इस पूरे process में? It took around a week. Like, let's say my first round was on Monday, then the second round was scheduled for t- uh, Thursday, hmm. and I finally uh, got call from HR on next Monday. So, like a week. Around a week. That's yeah. great. ठीक है. And Sandeep, you said that you know, um, interview में you had questions from programming part, Shala, and you know, even with the graphs topic and everything, you had helps from programming part, Shala. You could do it. So, come coming to your complete experience with even the Renaissance, how has it been for you? आपका problem solving better हो पाया कि पहले से ही अच्छा था. How was it for you? How's the journey for you with the Renaissance? Yeah. So I'll tell you what's definitely has been uh, very good because uh, after joining programming part, Shala. Yeah. Uh, right from the beginning, uh, the videos were uh, made in such a way that a person will think about like how to optimize a solution. Like we'll start from the most brute force approach, and then we'll always try to think about the efficient solution. Right. Like maybe we'll introduce some space and then try to optimize, and later on we'll further think like we need hmm. to eliminate space as well as possible. So that's how the mindset has been created, hmm. and it happens slowly. Like if we sit, uh, stay consistent, it will happen slowly over a period of time. Like after some time, you will realize that yeah, I've been I have made a lot of progress because after some time, I had a look uh, back at some of my codes, hmm. and I simply saw like I had written uh, just for loops in all the codes. Like I never thought about the time complexity. It was all brute force approaches. Yeah. But yeah. later on, I had to revisit at all my previous codes and try to optimize it, and I was able to do so. So uh, I think. uh program partial has made a huge effect on my mindset like how i look at problems and how i start working on them yeah. and basically uh, how i come towards the solution yeah yeah that's true that's true and that's great so and sandesh how did you like for the first time pata kaise chala programming partial ke bare mein how did you get to know about us right so as i said uh, initially i had made up my mind to get placed into a product based company and basically i had to look for some resource from where i can uh, learn because it was time to learn then i did not have a lot of knowledge about it hmm. so i started reading about different courses and i got to know pro- about programming partial from cora i believe oh cora reviews nice right. nice that's great that's great theek hai and any tips that you would like to give for resume building jaise aapka resume shortlist hua some people have faced this issue ke resume the very first round of screening hi nahi jata hai so any tips that you would like to share for you know making a very good or effective resume for resume i mean uh, you just have to actually mention a lot about yourself like whatever you have done don't feel a uh, less in confidence about that if you have done something just mention it like uh, i had a work experience in a support role so initially i thought that it would not be relevant for product based company mm-hmm. but later i talked with anup bari and he helped me in uh, framing the resume Yeah. and i added and i actually added a proper description for the work that i had done in uh, the current com- uh, previous company even though it was not relevant but I, it was really important because it shows what i have done in the last year true 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 so showing your experience perfectly you know not mentioning too much about yourself but instead mentioning about your achievements and you know all right. that you've done will help a lot with your resumes i completely yeah. agree with that so sandesh you made your uh, you know change or shift from सर्विस बेस्ड टू प्रोडक्ट बेस्ड फ्रॉम सपोर्ट रोल टू डेव रोल कभी ऐसा हुआ दैट यू माइट हैव फाउंड योर सेल्फ इन लैक ऑफ मोटिवेशन माइट हैव फेल्ट लाइक यू नो दिस इज बिकमिंग वेरी डिफिकल्ट फॉर मी टू सॉल्व दीज प्रॉब्लम और टू कोड एंड एवरीथिंग सो इफ यू फेल दैट वे हाउ डिड यू ओवरकम दैट सिचुएशन actually happened a lot of time because in uh, I was in a support role so in support role you basically have rotational shifts so I was not uh, sure like uh, i was not had a fixed time of solving the problems like my shifts had to be rotated after a few weeks and 
so i could not keep a fixed time to solve the problem so i was kind of uh, lacking in motivation like i thought i would not be able to do it by giving enough time yeah. but whenever i had any such issues i always reached out to anup bhaiya and he always assured me that the progress that i have made is uh, already good enough and i should just keep continuing it because i used to feel lack of motivation that maine jo bhi kiya hai maybe like start to kar diya but abhi atak gaya hu aake but anup bhaiya said like uh, whatever you have done even that is very important जो भी हुआ है उससे भी एक माइंड सेट चेंज हुआ है एंड बेसिकली एज ऑलवेज सेट कंसिस्टेंसी इज ऑलवेज द की वंस यू कीप कंसिस्टेंसी लाइक इवन गिविंग वन और टू आवर्स अ डे इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ट्रू ट्रू कंसिस्टेंटली अपना एक यू नो एक रिदम बना के रखना विद योर एफर्ट्स एंड आल्सो वन शुड फील लाइक दैट जितना भी किया है दैट इज फाइन इफ इट इवन इफ इट इज नॉट इनफ एट लीस्ट यू हैव डन समथिंग देन नथिंग राइट that should always be the motivating factor okay at least you have done something today then just sitting idle nas great sandesh thank you so much for being here it has been amazing having a word with you but before you leave any piece of advice for our fellow budding software development engineers what would you like to tell them how to prepare i would say i mean see there will be different phases once you start uh, starting on uh, start working on your problem solving like at some time you will feel that once you begin the momentum will be very speed but after some time you will feel like uh, there is uh, the progress has become quite slow but i would say only after a time once you uh, start solving problems on your own you will realize that you have actually changed your mindset like just after reading the problem you would realize that you can think of multiple approaches you can think of a solution at least and yes. it will happen over a time but yes. uh, consistency has to be maintained that momentum has to be maintained too yes. Yes, I guess not to be impatient with you know results. That today he chaiye or kali chaiye. Just be consistent with your efforts, and that's going to lead you to where you are. Thank you so much for being here, Sandesh, and congratulations on making this shift. I'm very proud of you, and everybody here at Pragyan Bhashala must be very proud of you. And thank you so much for being here, and I wish you all the best as you join Mr. Fly. Thank you so much. So I hope you all enjoyed the video. In case you did, please don't forget to give it a like and also hit the subscribe button, share it with your friends, and hit the link in our description section to take a free trial for yourself today and begin this journey of becoming the incredible software development engineer out there. If you are also someone who is struggling to make the shift from a service based to a product based or from a support role to a dev role, we are here for you. So you can always reach out to us from our LinkedIn. Uh, the link to the same is also mentioned in our description section, and I'll see you all in the next video.